Hey, what's up? It's Mandy from Dorset Vapor, and today we're going to be talking about the Jellyfish Box Mod by Lotus Vaping Technologies. So, we're going to go in a close up view and have some fun describing the jellyfish. So, here we go. So here is our jellyfish box mod by Lotus Vaping Technologies. This is the box that will come in. Sub ohm device all the way down to 0 0.25 to 3 ohms. It is a 7 to 53 watt box mod. It has LED screen, it has watts and volts memory setting, zinc and alloy ends, and this is made out of aluminum, micro USB charging port, and its charge capacity is at 4,000 milliamp hours. And it has two internal polymer lithium 3.7 voltage batteries. So let's open her up and take a look. And here it is. And this is the user manual goes over the basics with you. Comes in a foam casing. And here's your charger that will be charging on the side right here and you can only use this charger with it. You can't plug it into your computer. So no taking out batteries. It's all internal. You can charge your other media devices on here, like your cell phone and whatnot. And as you can see, it has the Lotus logo. Here's the bag. This is a gun metal, and it also comes in all white, which is very nice. It has your power button, up and down buttons, your jellyfish. This is the bottom. Here's your Addy Connect. This is a spring-loaded 510 connection. Like I said, resistance at 0.25 to 3 ohms. It has a property chip technology. So, to turn it on, you're going to press your button five times. And it goes, it talks to you. So I'm at 100% battery. This will be my ohm reader. Here's my wattage, and right here, the volts and wattage is what it is when I hit it. And as you can see, I have no atomizer, so it is telling me that. It has a really cool two-tank memory setting. You can put two atomizers or a tank, and it will remember your ohm and your wattage you wanted at. See right there, it tells me I have no connection, so. Okay, so in the user manual, it will describe to you everything that's on your screen and all the icons and those are your animations when you boot on and off and when you press the fun button five times which is your boot up button within two seconds to shut down the device keep pressed to vape so I'm gonna press my up button and this button this is what they call the fun button open screen close screen. See? And you can still vape it once the screen is like that. And then to get the screen back, press those two buttons. And you hold these two buttons down at the same time to go to your output voltage. And then back. When your device is low, it will say charge me right here. And when you press your to lock mode, you press your down and your start button. So I'm gonna press down and this button. And when it's locked like that, you your buttons to go up and down are locked, so it's sticking out what wattage you want. You got out of that, you just press your down and this button. And then you're out of that. And it also goes into sleep mode in the bottom right here. While in the illuminated screen standby mode, without any operations for 10 seconds, your device will automatically switch to the blank screen of sleep mode. At this time, press any key to wake up your device. However, if there are no operations for over 10 minutes, the device automatically shuts off. 
So the jellyfish mod. Enjoy your vape. Okay, so on here I have put the plume veil. I'm at 0.27 ohms. I'm gonna be at 51 watts. Right here in the top left corner, this is your power range. And as you can see when I hit it, watch the volts when I hit it. It'll tell me what volts I'm at. It also has pressed these up and down button at the same time. You can go to your volt screen. So it has round robin voltage and wattage settings. So you can adjust your voltage. See what that's at. And this is how you adjust your wattage. You can hold down, it'll go all the way down. And once I'm all the way down, it'll just round up again and just keep going. So it doesn't stop. See? This goes down. I'm gonna go to 50. And this is, the jellyfish is really powerful. It, on 53 watts, it hits like the IPv3 on 150. So, I will show you that. So that definitely fires up good. We're gonna zoom out and I'm gonna vapor. So, when you're charging your battery, it'll talk to you like, it'll say, I am full, when it's full, and the screen automatically goes off like after 10 seconds to save your battery. So it's on and it just goes into like standby mode. So the jellyfish has all sorts of protection. It protects against short circuits, heavy currents, low voltage, low resistance, and your temperature. So this is safety device and very powerful. So I'm at 53 watts. Good flavor, good everything. My favorite about this device is how it has internal two batteries inside their polymer batteries and how it says my battery's at 100 percent So that is cool. I don't know if you can see my voltage when I hit it. I'm gonna go in close to the fish. Jellyfish. So I was at like 3.71 volts. I'm gonna turn this down and I can still get clouds. So go down to 20 watts. If you talk quick, you might sound slick, but I also might think you just asked me to make you a real jellyfish sandwich. Jellyfish. Really nice. And I like how this also comes in all white. It looks really cool. Um, you can buy this product online at dorsetvapor.com or you can come into the store at Maryland Heights and we have this product on stock. Both in gunmetal, which this is, and in white. So thank you for watching my review video. This is Mandy with Dorset Vapor. Jellyfish. Jellyfish. I made this for you. The jellyfish. Or you'll die. Jellyfish. Jellyfish. Jellyfish.